A heavy snowfall has been reported in the higher reaches of Tawang since the 22nd of February and has resulted in the disruption of traffic and closure of roads as well. Now, beyond keeping the roads open for traffic, the BRO has also carried out rescue operations and evacuated approximately 70 tourists who were stranded at the Sela Pass. Meanwhile, our natural CM Pema Khandu congratulates the BRO for extraordinary efforts to rescue the stranded tourists. Remember, there have been several instances earlier as well in our natural Pradesh uh, around the same time when uh, uh, the snowfall increases. Uh, there, there are chances of avalanches as well and at this point uh, we're learning that 70 tourists have been rescued. Uh, my colleague Ratnadeep joins us with more details. Ratnadeep, take us to the latest coming in on the broadcast. Uh, we're learning that 70 tourists have been rescued. Uh, but what is the situation on ground? Well, uh, there have been a uh, snowfall which is happening in the upper reaches of Arunachal Pradesh uh, and uh, Tawang district which is uh, close to the border uh, with uh, China uh, always receives heavy Snowfall and uh, the tourists were uh, stranded, uh, and because of the snowfall, and then the rescue operations were launched. Uh, it was a difficult uh, operation because you know the, the temperatures uh, uh, go below uh, zero degree uh, centigrade, and therefore uh, now what we are picking up uh, that 70 tourists uh, who were stranded have been uh, rescued and they have been uh, evacuated. Right, uh, Ratnadeep. Uh, in fact, take us through the, uh, the situation in terms of traffic control as well. Uh, we are, in fact, getting visuals of the BRO ensuring that roads are clear enough for uh, uh, for transportation. Uh, but it seems like the, the it is uh, they are finding it quite difficult. Well, uh, you know, this is because of the terrain. Uh, when mm. uh, the, the, the terrain is such, the, the, uh, the, is a very difficult terrain. The road to Tawang uh, from uh, the lower reaches uh, uh, is, uh, you know, it is a serpentine road where uh, even when in the summer you have the challenges of uh, uh, landslides. So uh, around the clock uh, for the border roads organization, which maintains this uh, road uh, up to uh, the you know frontier with uh, China, uh, is full of challenges in the. Uh, you know, in the uh, summer, in the monsoons, you have to uh, keep the road open uh, for traffic uh, uh, and, you know, uh, the challenges of landslides are there. And in the winter, you have this heavy uh, snowfall. So, therefore, uh, you know, uh, they, uh, the challenge for them is to keep the uh, roads open. And also, if looking at the gradient uh, which is there, when there is a sn uh, snowfall, so there is a tendency of the uh, snow uh, uh, accumulating in uh, uh, in one uh, in you know in a, in a slanted way uh, on on the road, and that also leads to a lot of uh, uh, chances of uh, the vehicle speeding. Even if uh, the uh, road is open in terms of you know movement, but there would be uh, snow uh, uh, snow layers, and there are always chances right. of vehicles skidding. So. All those factors uh, uh, need to right. be, you know, uh, accounted for when uh, the border roads operates in these conditions and keeps the road right. open. Thank you, Ratnadeep, for joining us and bringing us those details.